here we are going to discuss about vibration of air column from chapter number 6 stationary waves you can see there are three diagrams showing pipe flows at one end in the diagram a you will be able to see only half of the loop therefore length of the tube is equal to lambda divided by 4 in second case you will be able to see there is one and half loop therefore length of the tube is equal to 3 times lambda 1 by 4 and in the third case you will be able to see there are two and half a loop therefore length of the tube is equal to 5 times lambda 2 by 4 now we know v is equal to n lambda therefore n is equal to v by lambda so in first case frequency will become v by 4l in second case frequency will become v divided by 4l by 3 that is n1 is equal to 3 times of v by 4l that is n1 is equal to 3n similarly in the third case n2 is equal to pi n thus in a pipe close at one end only odd frequencies are present